Welcome to our Q&A. Today we will be answering questions that y'all have asked. That's really all I have to say. Moving on. What does Void 1 stand for? Well, this is a complicated one. The dictionary definition of Void is empty space. So we are just one empty space, not knowing what we're gonna do in life. Void 1 stands for five people <laughs> that are a void, but they become one. All right, the actual idea of void is, like Brighton said, the dictionary version of void one is an empty space. Well, we believe in not wasting our lives away, as in you only get one life, that's where the one comes from. So Follow your dreams. So the sole purpose of void is to really influence, and it, it's to influence people to go follow their dreams, no matter how big they are, how young you are, how much people don't believe in you. Just really go out there and follow your dreams. Why do we sell Oh, hold on, Renee. Hold on, quick break. Renee texted him. Shout out Renee. The question is, why do we make merch? We make merch because why not? Why are you not making merch? The reason we make merch is because we're basic white we, and we only care about fashion. I'm not white. Also, <laughs> you're basic white. No, I'm not. You're basic white, all we care about is fashion. Also, it's not a source for income. We want to inspire people to follow their dreams no matter what, and when they wear our clothing brand, that becomes possible. Things you're looking forward to filming. Yeah. The thing is, we don't really come up with anything until like the day of, so. But, I mean, my idea there. is jumping into that pool that has tarp over it. Okay, jump into the lake after you lose a really bad challenge, like get destroyed. And then jump in the lake that's in my backyard. Stop being smart on me. All right, all right, hold on. We we, we talk about a lot of video ideas. They don't they really come on the top of our head. They're just thrown out. It just happens. They have ideas. Like climbing They're a just... tree and getting bit by a squirrel. Basically, somebody's brain says something stupid and then we go out and do it. Tips for YouTube. Consistency. Yeah, stay consistent. You want to be consistent. You want to you wanna make videos that grab your viewers in. Interesting thumbnails, interesting titles. Because think about it, when you're watching a video and you see a, an interesting thumbnail, you'll always click on it. Stay consistent, because you, you always have those people that they see a good video. They'll always like, go back to them like, every once in a while. Shout out to Icon. They, they're very consistent. Icon. That's not true. Uh, yes, the, the link is in the description. Yeah, Icon will be at the top of the description below. Go yeah. so check out the channel. I Icon is coming up right now, especially in the gaming community. We're I like watching their videos. Go watch them. Go check them out. What inspired y'all to start a YouTube channel? <laughs> so we had this Asian gaming clan called Polarize. And uh, Landon quit that that thing because it was taken over by Asians. So what he did was text me as soon as he quit and goes, I'm starting a new clan. You're going to be my editor. You're quitting Polarize with me. It was actually a gaming clan at first. And then we decided to start filming content. And that's where we're at now. So. Okay, for me, the, re the how I got into all of this was I just started promoting all of his streams and I became like... Basically promoted. the entire thing started as me streaming. And then I made him quit streaming. He was my promoter. I spent a week at his house trying to stream, but then we realized that doing stupid stuff is what we're good at. Brayden was my editor. I picked him. Basically, I've always kind of been an owner of clans and it just kind of runs with me. I mean, we don't really consider ourselves a clan right now. It's, it's really a friend group, a lifestyle, a family. We're like, we're literally a brother. Void One Apparel is not an apparel. It's not a brand. It's a lifestyle. It's freaking streamwear, shoddy! <laughs> Do y'all kiss each other? Heck no! Yeah, heck no. Birch is fired. Thank you so much. That, 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 thank you. Yeah. What has been your favorite video to film slash edit? Second video for me. The, oh. You put your head in the wall. The only reason he likes, uh, it's he because he's the star. Freak out. He only likes the video because he's the star. He made that video. No, Rise of a New Captain was fun though because that kind of like oh, yeah, yeah. sparked the pirate. I did a lot of stuff in that video. No, you, you really didn't. I you laid on a bed and I you died. You, you <laughs> got killed in the video. <laughs> yeah, he's dead. Constant rejection was super fun. For me, our, our most recent video was my funnest one. Best moments of 2020 was nice because it's a new just terrorist in town. That was good. Dude, new terrorist. That was a really fun one. Yeah. New terrorist in town is the opposite of racist. For the people that were concerned about new terrorist in town, that video was there was no racism implied at all. Mm -hmm. Who's the best void member? Me. Me. No, I'm just kidding. No, Who's the hardest yeah. working void? You and him. Uh, Brayden's up there. Yeah, yeah, me and Brayden do everything. Best looking void member. Peyton. Dumbest. <laughs> Miss Gutshaw. Him. <laughs> Stupidest. 
Him. Him. Lowest common sense. Him. Him. It thinks an 18 wheeler has 15 wheels. Him. It thinks dog water is when you put your dog in a bowl of water. Him. I didn't say. When was your idea to create boys? During May 15th, 1st, 2006. July 17th. Yeah, first bit yeah. July 17th. Is a hot dog a sandwich? No. Hey. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Two breads. Hey. Don't oh, no side with me on this. It is not a, a sandwich. sandwich. Not a sandwich. A sandwich has two pieces of toast or two pieces of bread. Separate. Hot Thank dog you. is connected. That is not exactly. a sandwich. Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. Hey. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Two breads. Hey. Don't no think. A hot dog is a piece of meat. A hot dog doesn't even include the bread. That's a hot dog yeah, that's true. If you guys could live anywhere, where would you live? I feel like this has been mentioned a lot. I think the best place when it comes to like houses and crap would be Texas. The Bay. The Bay. Dubai. The Bay. No. Dubai. No. no. Okay. I, want, I want to say in the US. Some, like a place being nice and a New place York. being convenient are two very different things. If you can find a really nice house in a convenient place. I want to have some in and out burger right now. I've never tried it. It sounds so good. That's not even remotely close to what we're talking about. Texas. All right, Texas and Tennessee and Mississippi and Alabama. Those are all in that and New York. In just that no, yeah. New York is no, New York is pothead city. How do your families feel about Void One? I say we start with my parents because they're the ones that we film everything here. They literally feed us every film day. Yeah, they they, they give us a lot of lungs and we they help they help us with the okay. And for me, my mom they just fine. My dad kind of hates it. My brothers. Your brothers are really supportive. <laughs> yeah, my brother's supportive of it. My younger brother thinks it's dumb. Your younger brother's jealous. Yeah, he's jealous. My mom. Teddy. I'm um, super supportive. She lets me come over a good amount of time. We've made many promises to them that once we get rich, we buy them nice cars. Our and manager. it's not even about the money. It's the fact that we're trying to make a living off of something that's like, to them, is not seen as something It's just possible. a new thing. Because yeah. Because their generation has never, like, seen any of that before. Yeah, like, they didn't have... Stuff How old is everyone in Void 1? 12. Yeah, we're around the age of 8 to 12. I'm Technically, 10. I'm the oldest one. We're 18. Yeah, okay, yeah. You're 15, like I'm 15, everybody else is 14. 14. Do you want to pursue YouTube as a full-time career in the future, or do you want to do something else? All right, the answer would be yes. I, I yeah. want to pursue YouTube as a full-time yeah. career. I don't know. I, 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 like, this stuff is just ridiculously fun. It's, it's, it's not fun. I mean, there's a lot of hard work that goes into it, and a lot of, bit, like, I had to drop a lot of sports just to be able to manage everything. You, met, you dropped one sport. <laughs> I Basically, the idea is we drop sports for this, so it's it's what we want to do. I dropped so many. Sports. This is my first video. I, I dropped the most. Right sports. Where do you see yourself doing YouTube-related things in the future? Uh, I see myself uh, owning a Lambo. It's like Tesla. It's not about owning nice things. It's about making what? content for people to enjoy. Oh, I just see myself doing what Land tells me to do. I think we're all gonna end up living with each other, probably. Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking. I mean, at one point we're all gonna move out and do our own thing, but we're always gonna stay here. Like, our kids are gonna be void too. Of course. And their kids are gonna be void. void. Are you working on new merch designs? Yes. 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 Always. Yes. We Currently. we would love to tell y'all about it, but we just can't right it's, now. It's, because it's exclusive. It's exclusive. Listen moment, to this but line. That let me tell y'all. It's, oh, like, it's like our first drop on steroids. Y'all are gonna love it. Yeah, we are working on a lot of merch designs and. There, there's a lot of things in the works that we just can't talk about right now. What have you learned from YouTube? I learned how to be dumb. Like, really you dumb. You already knew that, I promise. We yeah. learned not to care what other people think. Your yeah. own thing. Ever since we started YouTube, we've started giving less crap to nothing. Like, focus on ourselves. Focus on our path and not others. That makes us really selfish, but... And what, like, follow our dreams. Cause exactly. We never expected to be at a point where we could make merch, but we are. Because we have followed life. our dreams. For me, those were a lot of, like, the moral things we learned. But as far as, like, my education goes, I learned a lot about, like, business. We're currently running a merch giveaway on our Instagram. You can check our most recent post for the details. That'll be at the underscore void one. The underscore void one. Make sure you check it out.